so if you are actually new to the channel and if you are here for the android tv news uh, how to install the update and anything you can just quickly skip to this point in time and it will actually just skip all of the bullshit in my life and just directly get you to the point What is up guys, a new week, a new vlog. So this week I'm not doing any kind of rough shit cause literally the extreme success of my last vlog uh, which I got uh, kinda demotivates me. So I'm not going to do many stuff in this vlog. I'm just kidding. Uh, actually, I don't have anything to do in this week right now. I'm just a bit busy. But uh, this thing came around after searching years and years for the damn FedEx. The FedEx finally sent me the wireless charger. Literally, this thing is 4,500 rupees. A guy who never like bought a second charger cause literally he takes care of his shit so much that he would not even bother a 160 rupees charger is now using a 4500 rupees ch charger like literally what is even happening i didn't buy a pair of earphones uh, which were only 400 rupees cause literally i didn't think so now i'm using a 6000 rupees akgs time is good man what the hell even is this packaging like if you drop this from a like 13th floor it wouldn't still damage inside the box like literally it had more protection in i just uh, decreased it in order to show you guys on the video and as you can see wow pad is kind of big take it right away there you go that's the front side of it it has a leather on it and it looks kind of like a bigger version of lotte choco pie wow but the quality though let me slide it does it have a fan no i guess one of them samsung ones had fan there you go there it is i'm just kind of a bit gentle with all of the things which i just uh, first time get as you can see photos in right back it's a bit flimsy how they show in like the advertisement and that sun is just okay annoying me right now okay i try to clear it but it's just don't ask me why I didn't I do it earlier cause literally I'm an idiot. Now guys one huge thing from the past night I have one notice this is not fast charging like little fast half an hour or an hour I can't even remember and still it went from 6 to 38 it's warm as hell I can actually cook eggs on this thing it's never been this warm at all I could be end up buying this thing cause literally it's so lovely and so fast and quick too.
So it's Sunday 10 a.m. right now, and if you're asking them, did you again forget about vlogging something? No, actually, I was sick a bit because of I have a lot of heat inside me. That's why I have a very bad acne problem over here. Like no one in my family has that bad. Like I can't eat anything spicy at all. Uh, let us skip that up part. Uh, now talking about the tech part, like literally, that's actually the ending of the vlog. I wanted to make a dedicated video about this, like the Sony TV's Android Marshmallow update, because literally some of the XBR models, which are actually the 4K models, 4K HDR models, got actually the no good update, and mine is. the KDN 55W800D which got the marshmallow update last week which is a kind of bit bummer that the Sony told that they would actually give the no good update directly so if you're wondering why i am uploading a less because i'm just spending time with my family and friends not actually friends just with my family we are actually like almost 10 people in the house right now i was just busy in arranging a secret wedding anniversary for my grandparents they just crossed 50th anniversary so it's extremely happy to see that like literally i don't even know whether i will like live till 50 or not like literally our generation is fucked up like seriously a little bit of secret party so i was just busy in there i guess i would be vlogging cause literally it's uh, today evening so i want to close all of my videos right now so i want to just show you how you can install the marshmallow update on your android tv and here are some improvements so starting with the tv model mine is the kdl 55 w800d which is the 2016 model is one of the last one there is also i guess the 850d but it's not in asia there are also the 950ds which are a bit different they don't have a 800 hertz display i also they have a sound bar all of the 4k tvs did get the no good update only some of the x series not all of the x series so starting from the upgrade the main marshmallow the ui is not changed but there are many performance improvements including the remote like later you can point the remote at the sky and it still works i don't know how what kind of technology sony is using but still it's amazing uh, it's more smoother like later in this part i had issues in many kind of uh, lags and stuttering cause literally going through those menus was a bit laggy now it's totally been fixed through the marshmallow update there are some apps added over here such as a dedicated screen mirroring a dedicated side view app a dedicated photo share plus and also it adds more compatibility to the app so you will be seeing more apps into the play store which are more useful such as kernel auditor and stuff but you should see many more apps into the play store after the marshmallow update now for installing the marshmallow update it was a uh, not bit hard like literally my internet was so shit i was not even able to do a ot update cause literally we can't turn on the tv for i guess uh, seven fucking hours just straight so i downloaded the update file i extracted the whole file into a pen drive plugged the pen drive into the tv now tv automatically detects that it has a update file into the pen drive now it actually starts all of the process just automatically the process actually takes around 15 minutes to complete and there you go that's the only thing you have to do quite heavy 1.5 gigs to be exact in terms of recording there are many improvements done to the recording but as i didn't have any kind of pen drive with me so i didn't uh, showcase that but there are many improvements such as in recording you can set a timer and tv will automatically record the stuff for you there are many fixes to the netflix app also the camera app has a new smile feature but literally that 2 uh, megapixel camera ain't shit like literally i was trying so hard to smile but it was not detecting my smile at all so but you still have that feature so if you have a 4k TV I guess they have like a 5 megapixel camera which is a more much more clear for that kind of display now if you have 3D glasses too which i have not bought which is kind of a bummer like literally i am not using the tv to the full potential you will get a prompt that the glasses have been connected so that's a good thing now in terms of hdmi there are now support for the 4k at 60 fps like that is that's quite nice but you also need a good hdmi cable for that if you have a 4k model it will also provide a better upscaling in 1080p content which is a nice thing especially in india you get more app support more notification and some indian apps such as uh, made for india specific uh, content there is also lip sync in HDMI. the my input which is a bit weird i have to check that the health section is already totally new it has a new section over there it looks like the home but still it's more easier to look at also the ui is bit different as to the marshmallow standards it has a bit better explanation for example in the wifi section it tells you that the wifi is on it's scanning much more neatly also the standard not android tv aspects of the tv such as the this side panel which displays the all new streaming channels the video more video inputs and outputs a bit better which also has a more animation earlier it used to stay there and just a bar now it has more animations which is a good thing and that's pretty much it all of the sony apps such as the album video and the another walkman app album video all are just the same they get a bit of a revamp you will not notice it but they don't lag at all if you have some lower models such as the kdl 43 i guess 43 50 and 55 uh, the largest one the 50 and the 55 don't have that much of issues such as the 43 and which is kind of a bummer that we are at least paying 1 lakh for a tv so guys that's pretty much it thanks for watching this vlog right now there is no one in my house so i will just quickly edit this 
this vlog and just blast some songs till next 3 hours i don't have any work to do so guys thanks for watching see you in the next one there is a lot more things to come in the next vlog so you will enjoy that too bye bye